everyone, I'm Katherine Brown, VP of Executive Education here at Singularity University. I'm coming to you live from our Global Summit in San Francisco. I am thrilled to be joined by our CEO, Rob Nail, and the Deputy Dean of INSAD, Peter Zemsey. We're going to ask you a few questions about this exciting partnership that we're forming between SU and INSAD. So maybe just start by, maybe both of you could kind of comment about what makes this partnership so unique. Well, I mean, on, on the one hand, I think we've got complementary faculties that are really able to tackle probably what I, just the leading issue facing leaders today, which is how do you blend all the stuff you guys talk about in terms of being open and understanding technology change, and then how to actually turn that into responsible and effective strategies and execution. Yeah, I, I, I would add that uh, we have uh, similar mindsets around being very global by, by design. Our nature is uh, about addressing things that affect all of humanity across the world. Um, and, and maybe the most unique part is going to really come to light as we do start to work together more and more. Because I can tell you already, just the conversations, collaborations, the idea sessions we've had with Peter and Kyle, uh, they are very fun, they're very visionary, and I can, there is a wild roadmap of potential coming, coming, coming down the pipe. I think I, both organizations also, not just global, but we believe in diversity and yeah. bringing you know, the whole uncommon partnership and, and just the magic of, of doing that when you share a willingness to experiment and stuff. And I think that is just a, a surprising but, but fantastic energy so far. Yeah, yeah. I, I do think the, the roots of entrepreneurship, really being entrepreneurial minded, um, and, and impact focused mm. is a, a very exciting collision. Yeah. And, and so I think we have, we're going to be l uh, learning where that will take us for a long time. It helps, I think, that both of us have a mission orientation. So yeah, we're, we're, we want to um, impact leaders and stuff, but really help them address big problems and, and steward their organizations well. Right. Yeah. I think the alignment of both of our missions is one of the things that makes us most unique. Um, so we've chosen to focus on artificial intelligence as our first sort of course offering in partnership. Talk a little bit about um, why we chose to do that and what you think the potential is there. I can, I can say why we were so excited to work with, with SU on the topic. I think, you know, as, as Peter um, Diamandis talked about in his keynote, we're seeing this acceleration of acceleration and probably no place more than in AI, right? The ecosystem that's built up around it from big tech to startups, the hardware, the, it's just moving so fast. And again, you guys are so well positioned to help track how is that technology frontier moving. Yeah, I, I, I would add that it is a, a suite of technological progress that, that does touch everything. Um, it's also an area that is really confusing. A, a lot of people have no idea what it means. And maybe what's worse is that a lot of people are absolutely terrified by what it might mean because they don't understand it. And so, so I think there's a huge opportunity for us to, to help set a new lens, a new framework for how to, how to think through that from a very practical and, again, purpose-driven purpose, purpose dr driven direction. You know, it's, it's just, just in terms of the terror, you know, it's, people are just getting used to, oh, we're going to disrupt this industry, we're going to disrupt banking or whatever. And then you pull on them, oh, we're going to disrupt humanity. And again, um, just freaks people out. And then if you think about, if you're actually in an organization trying to lead this change, it's not easy. And if you're running up against those kind of emotions, it's, it's really even harder. Yeah. Um, we're leading this partnership with an in-person program, but there's a lot of potential in this. So we'd just love to hear from both of your perspectives. What do you think the potential is for this partnership, where it could go, what we could do together? Mm, wow, where to begin? Um, so again, I, I, I do think the, we don't have all the answers. I, th I think that things are changing fast. So a, a big piece of it is to combine our faculty, combine our communities to, to, to also understand who's really solving problems and how you leverage these technologies, how do we capture that best practice and create mechanisms to get it into the classroom right away. Um, so I, I do think there's that, there is that research element. Um, and then again, AI is just one of many topics where we can deploy um, our faculty. Yeah, I, I, I don't think I would add too much more other than to say there is a lot of possibilities and different ways to mix up visionary future possibility with practical realities of, of how, to, how to move things forward. And, and we sort of bring the best of both worlds. Great, great. What excites you the most about this partnership? This has come together quickly just, and exciting. Yeah, people. So it's, it's, just, it's just finding people who share sort of an entrepreneurial mindset, who, who care about having an impact. Mm -hmm. um, 
And Claire, I, and honestly, about global community. I mean, again, I mean, I, 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 as much as we're going to start in the Bay Area, this is stuff we want to bring out to the whole world. I think that's just hugely an important trend that we want to ride. Yeah, I, I think I think for me, one of the one of the fundamental um, tenets of, of the growth of SU and, and how we're going to make an impact in the world is is, is by bringing. Uh, ecosystems together in new ways. Creating uncommon partnerships is how, how Kyle likes to describe it um, and how, what we've really taken on. And, and the, the big opportunity here is that we are bringing a whole new network, a whole new ecosystem uh, together and, and that really does scale the potential reach, the potential impact that our, our communities can make. So. I mean, again, I, obviously we're not the same kind of organization, but that's, that's the, the beauty of it. And again, what we teach is in an era of rapid change, you have to collaborate, and you, you need to collaborate with different kind of organizations. And if it's just too easy to go and collaborate with people like yourself, um, but the real magic is to find people with different types of faculty, different ways you've, you've organized things, and, and find ways to blend and, and meld. If you put yourself in the shoes of um, all of the amazing individuals in our collective ecosystems, the people who will benefit from this partnership, what do they have to look forward to? I think as much as we're going to start with in-person, you know, you've got to be thinking about scaling. So, clear, I mean, the great thing about in-person is you learn really fast, um, but then to be able to, down the road, turn that into more like online, scalable knowledge dissemination. But then, I mean, for me, the real magic today is to blend digital and in-person. And I think you guys do that well already. Um, we do as well. So the ability to take, like, online solutions, have people in a location taking it, coming together, talking about what they're learning, um, how they're applying it, and, and to really to blend the, you know, the people in the INSEAD community and the SU community. I, I just think it's, it, there's gonna, like some magic that we can do. Anything to add? Uh, I, I mean, I think I, I, one of the areas that, that we're always getting asked for more of is um, where do you go next? What's, what's the next piece? How do I go deeper on the subject? Or, or how do I get the next skills that I'm going to need for this new vision and path that I'm on? And, and so I think this, one of the interesting outcomes of this collection, that there are just more potential paths that people can take on their journey. Yeah, great. Well, I know I'm personally really excited about this partnership and can't wait to sort of get it going. Thank you both for taking the time to have a conversation about it yeah. and yeah, look forward to the future. Actually, I think um, we are almost at the point where we're supposed to decide who's going to be in charge. Oh, yeah. So, so okay, so seven, five, four, three, Two, one. Okay, here, oh, we, here, go. We, go. Right, here go. we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is like, oh! No! Actually, you know, maybe. It's a stalemate. Uh, I think we're okay. We're going to do it all right. That's good. It's going to go be a Yeah, that's there great. You, go. <laughs> you never know what to expect here at Singularity. That's all I'm going to say. Earlier I got like wires on. Now I'm, 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 I'm arm wrestling. Um, it's never a lot of fun. Never a dull moment here. Yeah. Thanks for having us out. Thanks. Awesome. Thanks, everyone. everyone.